right, we're finally at the end of the road. I've got it mocked up on the test stand here. This test stand, uh, I've got bolt holes for the twins and the single K-series engines. Got a little nurse tank hooked up here, going to do a fuel filter. Yes, I know it's a gravity feed system and I shouldn't use that filter, but it seems to be flowing just fine. I've got tack hooked up and an oil pressure gauge hooked up. I've got a meter down here to check voltage to make sure the charging circuit is working. And I've got some fuel, spark plug, wrench, and a screwdriver for tuning. So I'm going to crank it over and see what kind of oil pressure we get. And then we will put the spark plugs back in and fire it up, hopefully. So let's check oil pressure first. Excuse the shop, it is a wreck right now. Anybody who's ever done this kind of stuff understands what's going on, though. Right at the end of the process, everything, all the organization just goes to crap. I just get super excited to try it. Uh, okay, so pull the spark plugs out. Battery's a little weak right now, so... Let's see what we get. So we hit 35 PSI and now it's dropping back down. We've got oil on the line there. Means the filter's hooked up right, filter's doing its job. Let's uh let's put the spark plugs in. Let the battery voltage come back up a little bit. Let's hook this up real quick. We'll just give it a little boost. Thirty seconds of I don't know how many amps a bunch. There it goes, it's starting to drain. Okay. A little anti seize on them, so they're ready to go. Um, I've already opened up the, the fuel shut off here, so we should have fuel flow. Battery's coming up to 13 volts now, that's good. Should give us enough to start it. plugs down. Now the throttle, I don't have anything going on for the throttle, so, you know, we're going to have to just play with that, I think. So we do have a spark. We're checking RPM over here. Um, I've got a wire hooked to the white wire, where it's technically yellow, but it looks white here. Uh, this is the kill circuit, so this should kill the spark if I touch it here. So that'll be how we'll shut it off. I have this stand set up with a key switch uh, for operation with the battery ignition systems, but this is not battery ignition. And the switch is actually kind of janky, so I don't want to uh, take the chance of one of those circuits crossing while I'm doing some of this and then... Um, you know, frying the magneto or doing something weird, so. Okay. I think we're ready. So choke is back this way, and no choke is that way. Let's check our oil again. Spot on. Exhaust is hooked up. I mean, I, I think we're ready to go. So that should have given her enough juice to get started. You ready? 
All right, this is it. some tuning to do but it's running carbs a little sluggish right now I'm not sure why we are charging it's about 1400 rpm we got about 40 psi oil there we're doing all right Let's see if I can kill it I can all right Let's open up the door and get some of the smoke out. It smells rich. 
I'm like a rich bog, not a lean bog. All right, I'm gonna play around with it, but uh, yeah, it's a uh, it's a running engine again. Fire's right out, man. <laughs> 